Good morning. So I wanted to encourage you to have artistic pursuits. You don't have to be artistic. You don't have to have any talents. I've been doing this stuff. Well, to me, it's just doodling, but I see that somebody has made a name for it and probably patented it so they could make money off of it. They call it Zen Tangles. So the Zen is from like, uh, you know, Zen <laughs> and Tangles is from Tangled Lines. You can see, no, I did not do that, but I like it. I like that the spiral curly cues, all the different designs. I just like that sort of art. So I like it so well that I bought that picture. I have other things in the house that I really like, but recently I have been making some doodles and I have a point in showing you this. Okay. All right, so let me lower down my little, there we go. All right, so the first one I did, I saw this thing on, I don't know, YouTube somewhere, said, draw, you know, just a zigzag. Then go from the top to the middle of the first line and draw a line, and basically just keep doing that. And then put a little design in each one of the, triangles. And you can see these are not complicated designs. They're just silly little doodles and lines. So I thought, oh, that was fun. So then I made one of these zigzaggy things and I thought, hmm, let me add to it. And I started adding all sorts of stuff. I did this, you know, just with a Sharpie marker. And I enjoyed that, so I thought, well, I'll make another one. And I just, you know, made some curvy lines that crossed each other. And I decided, well, you know, I did this and I thought, oh, let me, let me do this one next. I'll do this one next. And then I thought, I like this. I'm not gonna fill in any more. This is, it's kind of cool looking, almost, you know, a tribal looking thing. So, I went ahead and started to do another one, and somehow I did not like this. I don't, I don't know. I feel like this big thing doesn't go with the detail here. I'm not sure. You know, I'm gonna leave it, and uh, because very often the next day or in a few days you feel differently about something. So then I did this. And I like it. I just, I like it. Oh, by the way, when I was doing this, it was fun because I was just working on just making one line, making another line, you know, making some squiggles, some polka dots, some stripes. It was, it was enjoyable and also feeling the marker sliding across the page was really enjoyable. So, um, this one was very fun, and I did it a couple days ago, so I was thinking, you know what? I may add some watercolor to it. I'm not sure what, but just a little bit, you know, kind of color in some spaces and see how it looks. You know, maybe color in like here and here and the little spaces that don't seem to have these sort of leaf-like shapes. So... I wanted to encourage you, you know, you don't have to produce something that you can send to an art gallery or whatever. It's just fun to just make doodles. And this Zentangle thing, you know, you can uh, look on YouTube. There's all kinds of ideas because it shows you uh, little patterns you can make. And for instance, the one I just showed you, I actually looked at a video on YouTube to see what is it that makes those shapes so satisfying? And I saw that some of them, here, let me, hang on a second, put my glasses on so I can. Okay, so 
I saw that in all of them, they either start and end at the same point, or they start at the same point, and then they can end at a different point. But at least um, one of the two ends needs to be from the beginning or the ending point. So, uh, because I, I wanted to understand what it is that makes it look so interesting. But that was about as complicated as it got, and it was just a lot of fun. So, you know what? You don't have to produce some finished product. You can just enjoy what you're doing, and whether it looks like something when it's finally all put together, which is, you know, your opinion of what's put together um, or not, it doesn't matter because the wonderful thing is enjoying it as you're doing it. When you're done, if you want to, crumple it up and throw it in the trash, but enjoy the process.